Here's a Roku TV Select Series. I'm going to show you how to perform a factory reset. First thing is go to your home screen, click on the home button on your remote. Go over here, left side here, you want to scroll down to settings. Right there, okay that on the remote. Then from here, and then from here we're going to go all the way down till we get the system. System right there, select okay on the remote. Then from here, we're going to go down to Advanced System Settings. Advanced System Settings. OK on the remotes. And now under Factory Reset, move over to the right. And you can reset TV uh, audio and picture settings. Or we can Factory Reset everything. For me, I'm going to Factory Reset everything here. And for me to do it, it looks like they're giving me some kind of four-digit code down there. Let me select uh, Factory Reset everything. OK. It says press and hold to speak so I can use the mic and say those numbers or if not I can just move it down and that number I have is 5474. It's okay on that right there and read that. If you want to continue, start factory reset, then go ahead and okay that when it's highlighted. Restarting TV. Okay, there we go. And just went back to the screen here to pair my remote. So the factory reset is done and now we get this pair remote on here on the screen But we can go ahead and just turn the TV off and you can go ahead and sell it the TV or whatnot or if you just wanted to um, Go ahead and sell it, but already have the remote paired So they don't have to pair it as soon as they as soon as you sell it to them the first time Then you can just go ahead and pair it now. It doesn't really matter But I'll go ahead and show you how to pair it. Just open the back up You have this button right here. Just press and hold until we get like a green blinking light Okay, it's blinking. Give it a second there. Oh, okay, looks like we're connected. Get that check mark on there. And there you go. Anyway, I can go ahead and sell the TV now or have a fresh, new, clean sleep. There you go.